Are we live? We live. Yes. Okay, so I ain't going to curse. But these... So listen, we got Fresh and Fit, man. Fresh and Fit clips. I'm always doing no jumper shit, so I wanted to get a little bit on the Fresh and Fit. You know what I'm saying? I don't necessarily like these niggas, you know what I'm saying? But the shit they be saying sometimes, it makes sense, you know what I'm saying? Especially with the females and how they date and stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and play this clip. This is about a woman who is in a seven-year relationship, man, and still is not married. Her man still has not uh, said, will you marry me? So let's go head and... Get into the video, man. Let's go. You've been with yeah, your guy so for seven years, right? Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, are you guys, why aren't you guys married? That's a long time. Because. What are you talking about? I'm only Yeah, she ain't even nine. answering the fucking questions, bro. The 20s are thriving. How old are y'all? 20. <laughs> when I live there, I'm my 30s. Like don't be judging. Okay. Do you think you have more value now at 29 or later on? Now, but we about to get married. We be talking about it. <laughs> they be talking about it. They, 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 they be talking about other people, nigga. They ain't talking about them. <laughs> we be talking about it. Yeah, baby. Uh, I seen, man. Listen, marriage is a great thing. You know what I'm saying? But like, you know what I'm saying? We're going to take our time with it. You feel me? Me and you, we got something so special. Like, we got to wait a little bit. We got to wait till we get there. We got to get there first. That's what niggas be saying, man. Yeah, that's amazing. Weddings are a beautiful moment. No, he didn't. Well, we going to. No, what's the problem? Hey, man, she's happy, bro. Yeah, so so he he met, he mentioned marrying, but he never proposed to you. And y'all been together for seven years. The whole time, seven years, straight on, or was it on and off? No. I don't see a ring on your finger. Wow. Hey! Wow. Yeah, What's that got to do with anything, nigga? They... I'll address that in a second. But yeah, I um, think so. Yeah, it, that's ridiculous that she even said that. But that's fine. Uh, so she's from LA. Yeah. I am not from LA. We're from Pennsylvania. I live same in place. LA. That's even worse then. Goddamn. It's not. It's really not because people said from, from, from the DMV. Yeah, DC, Maryland, Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Well, she said Pennsylvania. Well, she's from PA. I'm from Maryland. State line, you know. The Mary St. Dixon line on the map. It's a straight line, and we're like ten minutes from each other on that straight line. Okay. But I'm from Maryland. That's what's up, bro. Nobody asked all that shit. Okay. So like, so you get she's it not now? From, you're from the DMV. She's not. No, I'm from the DMV. <laughs> all my family lives in the DMV. <laughs> Just because I'm ten DM. minutes across okay. the UP. straight line doesn't mean right. I'm not from there. Going back, because. Uh, uh, I'm just asking her. So you guys been together for seven years straight on never? Yes, but you know how that go. Oh, no, no, tell us. I don't. That's what I'm asking. Yeah, we don't know how that go, baby. Come on, you you know, don't know how that go. <laughs> you know, like, like living in Atlanta and Miami, like, people don't even, I don't know. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> All right, I'm going to ask him tomorrow again. <laughs> <laughs> call him right now. Hey, be beautiful. That's hey, all call know. him right now. So like, you guys, where the fuck okay, the ring at? you live here in where Miami now. Where the fuck now. the ring at? Cause you deserve it. All right, you live here in Miami. Where's he at? He live in New York. Okay. How often do you guys actually see? Oh each my god. Every day. How's what? That even possible? Because what are you talking about? We see each other like. I'm going to New York. My flight is at one o'clock tomorrow. It's at one. It's Delta. It's at one eleven. But if you live in Miami every day, even when because I Atlanta. don't want to live in New York right now. New York is scary sometimes. So okay, when he proposed to me, I'm gonna move back to New York, or he gonna move to Miami. But now I have a flight when to New York. When is that gonna happen? I have a flight. All right, I'm gonna ask him tomorrow. My, I land at four <laughs> thirty. So she's gonna ask him. <laughs> she gonna she didn't see him today though. Shit, every day. What does he do for a living? Yeah, this guy. <laughs> what does he do for a living? This dude. He's a contractor. All right. And how, how old is he? 34, I think. Yeah, okay. 34. So yeah, he's fly you out. What kind actually. of contractor? Government contractor? Real estate? Like, what are Real we talking? estate. Okay. So, and he lives in New York City? Yes, but, like, we both be back and forth. Okay. And you guys have been together seven years straight on? Yeah, since 2017. That was seven years ago, right? Mm-hmm. And he okay. claims you as his, his main girl? Why are 17? <laughs> he claims you? <coughs> yeah, I, I mean, you're not his main girl. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with him because you hot. Exactly. Like, man. Is this is the Morales. The answer tells him the Yes, he claimed me, but you acting like we be walking down the street and somebody be like, this your girlfriend. And then he be like, yeah. 
Like what? You talking about on Instagram that he claimed me? Like what? Yeah, people know that that we together. Do they really know though? Yeah. They obviously fucking know. Well, no, but then she came on strong. Then ask the question though, because you deserve the answers because you're worth it. Do you feel Thank me? Thank you. Thank you Babe, so much. I'm being for real. Thank you. She deserves no. the answers because no, she you're not. Me. You're being drunk. That's what the fuck you're being. You're being drunk. I'm being for real, babe. Shut the fuck up. She's worth it. That's okay. What I this said. is the difference between women and men. I'm gonna give it to you straight. He's been with you for seven years. He hasn't proposed. He don't like you that much. That's fucking mean. Now that <laughs> it's the truth, though. This is the difference. <laughs> That's fucking mean. You need to leave. That's what the fuck she sound like. Between That's men and women, no. like, look, 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 Go on a date with you. Just be quiet for two seconds. Let me just I keep have it a thousand. Dates, actually. That's fantastic. And um, I was talking about your friend over here, but if you want to take it to yourself, that's that was fine. That's so whatever. fucking heavy. The point I'm trying to make is okay, <laughs> is that if a man's been with you for seven years and he, he hasn't proposed, cry. one of two things. He either doesn't like you that much or there's another girl in the picture that he is higher elevated than you. No, that is not true because, okay, so like yesterday, when was the fight De- with the Devin Haney the dude? Yeah. Right? His girlfriend, the Lena girl, she had posted the ring with like a bunch of different girls. She was like a whole lot of wife shit. I saw and that. And he's, you seen it, right? I saw that. Yeah, that was lit. I saw that. He sent it to me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so she's using the fact that he sent her a picture of her no, engagement but ring. Like, he was just like trying to like show me like, like that's how I want you to be. I yeah, want you to be like, with your home girls ringed up. We get married like, and that was just when was that fight? That yeah, was on she, Saturday. Sorry. Like, we gonna get married? Yeah, right. You wanna come to the wedding? Uh, um, bro. You know what's funny? Women are. Uh, We're telling them how guys really. Yeah, think. and they're, they're just they, trying to like yeah. fucking that. That is the definition of delusional right there. Thank you how for proving my point. Like, bro, if a dude's been with you for seven years, bro, he's leading. You on. Maybe he is trying to marry you, but it's a fucking point zero 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 one percent chance that that nigga is for real, bro. That nigga is not about to marry you, bro. And he hasn't married you or like given yo. you a serious relationship or something like that. Cause, yo. Cause, the, the, honestly, t- to me, it sounds like y'all just fucking see each other period time to time. He sells you a dream and you're just hanging on. I'm gonna tell you this. He got some tight games. He got some other girls. 100% you got some years? other checks, bro. You ain't the only one. That's some pretty good game Definitely right there. not. Yeah, man. That's a fact. You got he just holding you on. I'm going to ask him tomorrow. <laughs> the fact you even got to ask proves my point. You know you're not the number one girl. You know you're not. <laughs> bro, that shit crazy. Mackenzie. Holy. Is this yours? This is fucking wild. What the fuck? That is so disrespectful. How's it disrespectful for t- being honest? Because, okay, so where the other girl at? You won't, you you won't see her. See. No, no, no. 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 <laughs> never around. I'm always with him. I don't see no, you're not. Home. You're not with him right now. Yeah, because I came here. Hold on. Where's he right now? He is in New York, but my flight is at 1 no, 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 no. What's he doing right now? You don't know. What you, you doing right now, he's nigga, on the podcast? He's with. Living on the other side of the country. You don't know what he's doing. I'm about to go to his house when I land. So what's cool. cool. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, That's cool. so what are you going to say to the girl? Oh, my girlfriend's coming right now. Yeah, yeah. yes. They do that. Happens every day. They do that. They so do if that. he's doing all of that, oh then I obviously got to be number one. <laughs> it's all about being the main at the side. This is like, fucking crazy. What? This is crazy, bro. Side chick fever, my nigga. Yo. Yo. You are cooked. No, man. Oh, my God. And you know what's crazy? Like, we weren't here to tell you. You wouldn't even know. You would just go with her and be like, yeah, I got a man. Like, you wouldn't even know. You would believe her. <laughs> you watch people complain in the past to? like two hours about dudes flaking on her. Why she was at a, the blind, the phone your blind, bro. My phone broke. Are bro. you pointing to me or her? I pointed to you. You're the Why? one trying to. You're, you're literally. She said. It's Bro. better your delusions. She I'm telling her the truth about what it is. Tomorrow, I'm telling good. her the truth that, yo, you're probably not the main girl. He probably isn't going to marry you. And he probably has another chick on the side that you don't know about. And you're just not number one. You're like maybe a side chick. And then you go ahead and say, no, you're the main one, blah, blah. You reinforce the delusion that she's I in right now. I didn't even say that. I just said she's going to find the answers tomorrow. Exactly. That's it. Exactly. No, she's going to find them fucking out. He's going to delay even further. Yeah, bro. But I didn't say she. I didn't say that. I just said, girl, find you the answers her tomorrow. You to be more. No, I, you? I Yo, just crazy. said to find the answers no, tomorrow. I think that's for encouraging you. And, and, and encouraging? Yeah, what does yeah, that mean? Yeah, First of all, I don't have any kids. I'm not engaged. I'm not in a serious okay. relationship. Why is that a problem? 
Nobody Why are you giving moment. advice if you ain't even in that shit? You don't. You don't. How do you have the answers if you're not even in that situation? That's literally dumb. That's like me trying to tell the pilot how to fly this fucking plane and land so we can get to the next destination safely, bro. That's the exact same thing. I'm trying to, I'm going to him, hey man, listen, this is what you got to do. This is, you good, bro. This is how you got to do it. That's exactly the same thing, bro. She's, okay, she's I do have the answers. I know what I want. I know what I'm looking for, and I'm not setting them for until fantastic. I get it. That's fantastic, but the point is is that you can't get a guy to commit to you, which is I can't. evidence I've in itself. I've had several men propose to me, and I've denied it, but I'm not going to talk about that on want. this show. Yes, yes men, you had losers propose to you. Fantastic. Losers. Yes. Oh, okay, that you don't you're like. just going to automatically assume they were losers? You don't like them. If they were winners, you would have been with them. That's not the truth. The truth is is that women have a type, and sometimes our type is not the man that we need to be marrying. So, you know, first of all, the guy that proposed to me, he was not a fucking loser. So don't ever say that. It's just it was a long distance relationship and and certain sicknesses were going on in the world. Don't ever say that. So it didn't work out. So don't say he's a fucking loser. If you don't like him, he's effectively a loser. Uh, no, it's just certain sicknesses that I can't talk about were going on in the world and it didn't work he's out. He's effectively a loser and to you because you didn't want to marry him. And we would, if we you, if he proposed to you and you situation. don't want it, then he's a fucking Wait. loser. I don't know what to tell you. In your eyes, maybe not to another woman, but in your eyes, he's not worthy. Wait, so he, you didn't marry him. He broke up with you or you broke up with him? I broke up with him. Oh. Why? <laughs> Why? You can't make this shit up, I'm not, I'm not gonna. Do you want up. me to tell you why I broke up with him? Do you really want to know why? That's not the point. The point I'm trying to make is, is that I saved his fucking if, life, and I couldn't marry a man that I saved his life. I wanted the man that I marry to be the one that saves my life and can protect me. And I so he's a loser. Life, and I just felt like there was an empowered balance. Exactly. I want to be the feminine, and I he wants to be the masculine. Make this shit up, Yo, bro. This is incredible. No, exactly. you know, I she saved his life and said, "I can't be with him." I didn't want to get heavy, but you want me to get Thank heavy? Thank you for proving my point. I, I want to oh. be the feminine, and he needs to be the masculine, and if that's not going to happen, we me can't too. get married. That proves my point. He's a like, loser. He had to get saved by you. Fuck. God damn. Yeah, no, it's not even like that. He you was like drowning. Oh, he, he's drowning. <laughs> he was fucking drowning. I live in Hawaii. I'm from Bro, Hawaii. so she... The nigga drowned. <laughs> the nigga's drowning. And you saying that because you saved him, you can't marry him because you saved him from drowning? Bruh, what? Man, what in the world is, is going on, man? This is insane. I can't be with him because he was drowning and I saved him. Like Hawaii. And he went out too deep and he started drowning and I saved his life. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, I'm not laughing at that. That's not fucking yeah. funny. That's not fucking funny. That's not fucking funny. I saved him from drowning no, and then I can't it marry him. I saved his life and she, I'm like, you know what? I love him. Guy. But I can't be, I can't marry a man that like I have to save his fucking life. Yeah. He's a respectful man. He's a like, good man. But it's just, it's just, yeah. I can't but do it. But if you can't swim, like, fuck you. <laughs> like in Japan, there's If you can't swim, it's different. Over. Bro. This is fucking comedy. Uh, you can't swim, I'm done. She says, Hold on. Like, like, that not is not hilarious. Learn how to swim. Yeah, my ick is, my ick right, is the list. please know how to swim if you're going to visit Hawaii. Period. <laughs> Wow. Because so. I told you not to go in the deep end and he fucking did because he was prideful and then he almost died. And that effectively that. makes him a loser. You know what I mean? I don't want to tell you. Like, like, bro, only like, losers need to be saved, right? Like, bro, if, if... He wasn't. He was a very kind and respectful man and I respect the girl he's with now and he's engaged and I'm happy for him. I just met them like two weeks ago in Tokyo. <sighs> I'm happy for him and I'm supportive, but I'm on my own vibe. Like, bro, I'm not toxic. Bro, what if in the fuck? If you can meet fiance and be respectful... This is not... Not real, bro. I, I'm, I look, man. Jaw, jaw is dropping. You can say whatever yeah. you want to say, man. I'm just but... saying the truth. That's my life. Okay, we heard your piece, bro. Holy okay. Holy. <laughs> yeah. Yo, you know, this is why guys are flaking on you, by the way. <laughs> because I saved their life. No, no. you're insufferable. <laughs> like this is incredible. Like, like you, you. D <laughs> Yeah, well, I, I wouldn't want to be around this bitch. I you ain't are not lie. pleasant to be sorry, around. I'm Holy sorry, crap. You I'm talk too much. Sorry. You complain about things that are completely in your control. Yo. This is why men don't want to complain. Uh, <laughs> no, like, no, no, what you want to Take you drone. seriously. Oh, like, yeah. Oh, 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 nigga, nigga, want to just end it. I know this shit, man. I'm out. You know, like, bro, like, you are in fucking trouble, man. Just being a thousand with you. I'm out. Peace. Like, the reason why guys are flaking on dates with you, don't want to meet up with you, etc., is because they look at you as a only category. Like, this is not a girl I could take seriously. This girl is annoying as hell. 
And that's the thing. A, a couple of you guys here on the panel are annoying as hell. I keep it a thousand with y'all. This is why men don't want to take y'all seriously. You can sit there and say, I got options. Yeah. To we fuck. don't want to take them to, to serious. Fuck. But that's that's I know you opinion. ain't talking. You in a seven year relationship, he ain't committed to you yet, man. Come oh on, man. You a side chick. Why you keep saying you that? You a side chick, bro. Now, why do you keep saying that when you know? I didn't want to say it, but like, you know, like, black men be taking men successful? Be taking hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Is, is, look, 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 look. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. Is your man successful? He make money? Yes. Okay, is he good looking? Get money. Is yes. he good looking? Is he yes. tall? He regular height. Okay. Let me give you a little secret. When men have success and money, etc., we put girls in categories, we put them in side chick. Maybe a main chick, etc. We put women in categories. Y'all just never know about it. That's that's okay, bad. Okay, I'm sufferable apparently. Yeah, you're, you are. About it though, we do. We do. If you and did, then you would overcome it. Y'all take it seriously. The they side ain't side saying nothing over here. They ain't saying shit. The girls that that dude got. So how am I a side girl if I never see the other girl? Because sometimes you don't know. That's why you're the side girl, precisely. <laughs> no, sometimes the you don't side know. girl you don't be see knowing. A nigga could be a side nigga, don't even know what you're talking about. The dude girls. be like, I gotta such and such. This is happening. That's what's happening. <laughs> like, Yo. Yo, a this shit crazy. A real man. A real man. Well, now it's a real man. real man. Now it's a real man. man. We'll do that. Yeah. Man, listen, bro. That is, that was a crazy little situation with just transpired, man. The, la the girl in the white, she need help. She need to, she need to seek somebody. Seek therapy or something, bro. But anyway, man, that's it, man. I'm winning any motherfucking way. I can't lose. Shit, you can shoot me, but you can't kill me. My nigga. 